college application resume gives you the opportunity to provide a consolidated list of accomplishments and indicate your level of fit with the school. The career-oriented resume that you are used to developing through your professional career does not work here. You need to write a new resume for business schools because you need to have space on it for your academic strengths and leadership in the community, cultural events and sports involvement, more than you would for a professional resume. So what should you include? Here is a suggested breakup. Number one, the header, which includes a name, address, phone number, and email ID. Then number two, education, including academic awards and honors. This section includes your, the name of the undergrad institution and any postgrad study, academic statistics like rank or GPA, years attended, location, duration, degree obtained, and any other academic related information, like were you an RA or TA, for example. You can also include any other academic certifications that you hold, like a CA or CFA. Number three, your professional experience. You should include the following things in this section. The name of the company, designation and department. You should include the length and location of experience and break your role into specific job functions and describe what you did within each function and explain if you delivered with regards to that function. What were the impact and results of your work? Next is your leadership experience. Here you discuss leadership roles held outside of the professional and academic realms. Engagement in sports, community service, clubs, forums, and so forth. Then there's skills and interests. This section includes technical skills such as proficiency with computer software or language skills like fluency with a foreign or domestic language. Mention two, three personal interests such as travel, sports, etc. But be specific. Don't just say traveled to 50 different states or uh, play tennis. Specify where you've traveled to and which sports you're interested in watching, playing, and to what level. Finally, there may be a heading for certifications or community involvement. It would really depend on your personal background. Remember, the MBA resume can generally only be one page long, but please check if there are any other specific instructions provided by the university with regards to length or content. Thank mm -hmm. you.